So in today's video, I'm going to be shooting the Fuji camera again with some Spyd 400 Fuji. Now, shooting Spyd 400 over a decade old, you bring it back to around 200 ISO. Now, I'll leave some links on other videos with people talking about why you do this and the results they have from that, as I feel like they've done a better job at doing it than I would. And alongside this I'll be shooting up some digital images just in case the weather turns bad and you'll find out that it does. So hopefully you enjoyed the video and you enjoy my dog Ringo in it. And don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. So as we arrived at the campsite, it was still chucking it down. You can't really tell how bad it was, but I can assure you that it was just miserable. It wasn't what we expected. So we just decided to find a local pub where Ringo could sit in and have some dinner. And that just turned into a long few hours of just a couple of beers and ended up just going back to the RV and just chilling out for the night. So with that, being said I've started shooting just in and around the RV and just think about different crops as I haven't shot digital in quite a while and just wanted a more cinematic approach to what I was shooting and just thinking about how cropping could change the aesthetic of an image or how it could enhance it in certain aspects. So I definitely would want to come back and re-photo the landscape around here. It was just a shame that it was miserable weather, but I did enjoy my time with the dog and my dad, especially during COVID. Just getting away for a day or two was nice. And if you did enjoy seeing Ringo in the video, expect to see Lolly, my other dog, in the next video, and hopefully you'll enjoy her being in there. So enjoy the last few photos and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. If not for me, at least do it for Ringo.